Certainly. Here's some additional information you can include in each section of the Comprehensive Guide on Demystifying ESB API Manager. I. Introduction to ESB API Manager. A. Explain how ESB API Manager serves as a centralized platform for managing APIs, allowing organizations to expose, secure, monitor, and control APIs. B. Discuss the increasing importance of APIs in digital transformation initiatives and how ESB API Manager helps organizations leverage APIs for innovation and business growth. C. Highlight key features such as API lifecycle management, security, analytics, developer portal, and integration with other systems. 2. Understanding ESB API Manager architecture. A. Provide an overview of the components and modules that make up ESB API Manager, including the API Gateway, Developer Portal, Policy Enforcement, and Analytics. B. Explain how ESB API Manager integrates with an ESB, acting as a bridge between APIs and backend systems. C. Discuss the role of ESB API Manager in ensuring API governance, enforcing policies, and facilitating API versioning and lifecycle management. 3. API Design and Development in ESB API Manager A. Detail the process of designing and defining APIs using ESB API Manager, including creating API specifications, defining resources, and setting up request-slash-response mappings. B. Highlight best practices for API design, such as following RESTful principles, designing for scalability, and ensuring consistency across APIs. C. Explain how ESB API Manager supports various API development languages and frameworks, allowing developers to work with their preferred tools. 4. API Security and Access Control A. Discuss the importance of API security and how ESB API Manager provides authentication and authorization mechanisms such as OAuth, JWT, and API keys. B. Explain how ESB API Manager enables the implementation of security policies, including rate limiting, IP whitelisting, and payload validation. C. Touch upon handling common API security threats, such as injection attacks, cross-site scripting, XSS, and unauthorized access. V. API Governance and Monitoring a. Describe the concept of API governance and how ESB API Manager helps organizations establish policies, guidelines, and standards for API development and usage. B. Highlight the role of ESB API Manager in enforcing API policies, ensuring compliance with regulatory requirements, and managing access control. C. Discuss the monitoring and analytics capabilities of ESB API Manager, including tracking API usage, performance monitoring, and generating reports for insights and optimization. 6. Integration with Backend Systems A. Explain how ESB API Manager facilitates seamless integration between APIs and backend systems, supporting various protocols and data formats. B. Discuss the data transformation and mediation capabilities of ESB API Manager, allowing for data mapping, transformation, and enrichment. C. Provide examples of common integration patterns, such as request-slash-response, publish-slash-subscribe, and event-driven architectures supported by ESB API Manager. 7. Deploying and Scaling ESB API Manager a. Discuss different deployment options for ESB API Manager, including on-premises, cloud-based, and hybrid deployments. B. Explain scalability considerations, such as load balancing, clustering, and caching, to ensure high availability and performance. C. Provide best practices for optimizing ESB API Manager, such as resource utilization, caching strategies, and performance tuning. 8. ESB API Manager Integration with Other Systems 
A. Explain the integration possibilities between ESB API Manager and Identity and Access Management IAM, systems, including single sign-on, SSO, and user authentication. B. Discuss the benefits of integrating ESB API Manager with API marketplaces and developer portals, enabling self-service API discovery and developer engagement. C. Address the challenges and considerations when implementing ESB API Manager in a hybrid or multi-cloud environment, including data synchronization and security. 9. Real-world use cases and examples. A. Present real-world case studies that demonstrate successful implementations of ESB API Manager across different industries and organizations. B. Share industry-specific use cases, such as healthcare, finance, e-commerce, and IoT, highlighting the unique challenges and benefits of using ESB API Manager in those domains. C. Provide practical tips and lessons learned from actual ESB API Manager deployments, including overcoming implementation challenges and achieving business objectives. X Future Trends and Innovations in ESB API Management A. Discuss emerging technologies and trends that are shaping the future of ESB API Management, such as serverless computing, event-driven architectures, and GraphQL. B. Explore the role of ESB API Manager in cloud-native architectures, microservices, and containerization. C. Make predictions about the future of ESB API management and how it will continue to evolve to meet the changing needs of organizations. 11. Conclusion A. Summarize the key points covered in the guide, emphasizing the benefits and significance of ESB API manager in modern enterprise integration. B. Encourage readers to explore and leverage ESB API Manager for their enterprise integration needs, highlighting its ability to streamline API management, enhance security, and drive innovation. C. Provide recommendations for implementing and leveraging ESB API Manager effectively, including training resources, community support, and staying updated with the latest features and enhancements. Remember to provide clear and concise explanations, use examples and illustrations where applicable, and include references or external resources for readers to explore further.